Yeah. I'm Taj. I'm Terrell. And I'm TJ. And we're 3T. Okay. Where's the name come from? The name comes from um, our mother. She used to call us her 3Ts all the time. And for the, the music group, our uncle thought it would be stronger to drop the T's and just make it T. So it's now 3T. Okay. And what, what kind of instruments do you play? I play uh, keyboards mainly and a little bass. I play piano, keyboards, and guitar. And I primarily play guitar. Okay. Uh, what is um, the, your part in the band? I, I don't know. I think we all have similar parts. Um, I would say probably for this band, it would be organizing and, <laughs> and managing. <laughs> I mean, I try to do what they don't do. Okay. You know, I'm the youngest, so it's like all the, the good okay. slots were already taken be before I could even talk. So I try to just fill up the gaps. And what do you do? I'm the leader. No, I'm just kidding. I'm the, um, I like the visual stuff. So anything with visuals, graphics and stuff, or film related, I, that's where I get excited and that's what I like to do. Okay. What's your part? We, I think we all do, we all do a little bit of everything. But um, I like to do the music and production, but we all, like I say, we all do a little bit of everything. In this life, we all search for that one to call our own. What's the happiest moment of your childhood? childhood? Uh, there's, I had a wonderful childhood. Um, so there's a w lot of wonderful moments um, playing young sports with friends. Um, doing shows with my brothers for our families, um, traveling with our uncle and uncles. Um, I, had a, I had a wonderful childhood. So there's a lot of experiences, kind of too many to just pinpoint one. Mm -hmm. Did you go um, a lot with your uncle? Yeah, we would. Um, he would sometimes pull us out of school, and we'd be on a flight to you know Asia or somewhere South America, you know, and watching him perform stadiums and come off stage and be such a normal person and then go back on stage the next day and in front of hundreds of thousands of people sing and dance so that was a pretty cool experience that I got to experience as a kid mm -hmm. Was it weird to experience that your uncle was um, that famous? Um, it was different, it was very different um, but at the same time it's like it's a, what we knew and, and I think it was more exciting just to see him be our uncle and that and the bond that we had with him that way and then when he would go on stage see him transform into this you know person that everyone you know it was just, it was just a surreal experience but it was it was amazing with all my heart i believe that you are my forever girl i just graduated from college university um, which is something was important to our mother and our mm -hmm. uncle Michael. Um, so I'm very proud of that accomplishment. And I also did it because I have kids and I want it to be a good example for them because I'm strong on education and I didn't want them to ever say, but you never did this or you never did that. So now I can say, I did it, you can do it. What kind of study did you do? I did business. Um, business administration is what it's called in the U.S., and um, it was a lot of work, but it's something that I've always had a passion for, um, was business and learning since I was young. Mm -hmm. So I was happy that I was finally able to finish, and I'm looking into doing more schooling. What, I, um, what have you done? I study film and film directing and stuff. Um, so I w watch a lot of movies, read a lot of books, but also I've taken a lot of classes, and I Went to college, but I didn't finish like TJ did. I'm contemplating going back, but um, my last year was the Brotherhood tour. Yeah. So I, I left college to travel the world and, and promote our album and stuff like that. But I'm contemplating going back. I'm a lot closer to finishing than Terrell is because Terrell went, mm -hmm. and I went to the same college. Okay. But I had a head start on because I'm older. I was studying uh, recording arts at college. Um, but I still today I'm learning. There's there's it's so there's so much information on the internet now that you can really take a lot of courses and learn through YouTube and tutorials and things. So I'm constantly learning my craft and trying to improve it. You can never you you can never know enough, you know, and that's the thing. If you you can constantly keep learning because there's always something you don't know. Mm -hmm. And that's and that's a good thing. See sometimes it's
You're bringing a, an album uh, out, an album uh, really soon. What's it called? We don't have a name yet. Okay. So it's untitled. That was the name of the album. It's just <laughs> we don't have one yet. Okay. So it's untitled at the moment. We don't know. We usually f pick it, you know, unless we have something that we're very strong on. Um, we usually wait till after the album. Mm -hmm. So, so we have, have all the songs together. So you can choose uh, mm -hmm. a total. Mm -hmm. Have you finished all the uh, the songs? Not yet. Um, we're very close to finishing. Um, we're still work. There's probably two or three more songs that we would like to do. And sometimes you then there's another song that you throw in at last minute and stuff like that. And that's how anything happened for, with the Brotherhood album was anything with a last minute edition and that ended up being our first single. Mm -hmm. So you never know. You just keep writing and recording up to the point where it's it needs to be in. Okay. What is the album about? Um, it's different songs about different things, but the album, I would say, for any of our fans is, is a lot more mature. Um, a lot of live instruments. Um, the sound is is quite more grown up. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, we. I think we've, over the years, become real um, serious about, you know, the art side of it. You know, just because it's any, there can be simple and and complex art. Um, but I think for us, we've, we've really gotten into organic musics and making it real, so that when we go on the road, we can kind of duplicate that. Organic okay. musics, um, like just raw instruments. Okay. Um, you know, using instrumentation from strings to you know all the percussive instruments to dr live drummers and as as live as it can be. Mm -hmm. You know. Okay. Never be a part. 